Hey Zinge Boy, welcome back once again to Mushroom Kingdom Meltdown onto Aquatic 2. Hopefully, the uh, game will not break on me, because that would be very, very sad. But this is also a red level, so I need to keep an eye out for secret exits that are not just uh, torpedoes and pipes. Well, that's something that's, that's not suspicious at all. You know, the uh, block, or the pipe that's blocked off with a P switch. Hmm. And that looks like something that I probably want to keep in mind that there's a keyhole right there. And the fact that there are. Frick. Blocks. And say, okay, now I need to go back back so I can uh, go in this pipe the actual one that lets me go in it probably to get the key hey look a key and a feather leaf whatever close enough and now I can go back and get backwards it's like, that's not right it's not where I was there we go so there's the secret exit which goes all the way over here for some reason to uh, cookie mountain I'm going to do cookie mountain really quick um, yeah I had a feeling that that's what it was going to be so now that that's over, let's go back on down and go back into Aquatic 2 and I'll get back to where I was. Okay, I'm back to where the key was. I figured that's a good enough spot to continue from so I don't play the entire level over and over again. And now I can go and continue on the lower half of the level if I so choose. But, there we go, there's the goal. Uh, playing, just playing through most of the level, getting the secret exit, and then having to play through it again, it's just, that's not really that fun for me. Because it's like, yeah, I did the level, good for me, now I get to do it again. <laughs> Okay, time to make your brain cringe. I'm tired of trying to get to you physically, so I will try something else. Oh no, let me guess. Oh no, I have to kill myself how many, many times because they're tiny little mole people. Well, no, it's time to kill the mole people because why not? No real point not to. Now I have to wait for a pokey. Come on. Freaking A. The slowdown is real. Slowdown is so real. Okay. Well, with that out of the way and done. Go and uh, beat up the strange Warriors which seem to be missing the top of their head and brain area because they have no real hair. So I have a feeling these are failed clones that uh, are mutated, have no real brain to them. And that's why they're attacking Mario's because they don't see him as an equal. They see him as strange because he has a hat. That's, prob <laughs> that's probably what it is. The moles see them as strange because he has a hat. Okay, where does this take me? It takes me over here to another red level. Another red level. I kind of dread the red levels now. It's like, oh, yep, now I get to play the level twice again. Oh well. Could be worse. Could be 
a whole lot worse. It, every, I mean, it could be that every single one of them, the secret exit was like right at the end of the level. So, I mean, there, there's that could be what happens. But, uh, nope. At least it does give me some bit of variety in how it does things. But I just have to figure this out. Where the secret exit is. Oh, stop it. Bad Mario. What I want to do is hit them with my cape to be able to, like, squish them the way I'm intended to do it. Okay, come on. Can I? Yes. If I just go a tiny bit faster and tiny bit slower, can, in fact, do that. Though now I have to wait for this. Then wait for that. Somehow get hurt. And then wait for this again. I mean, that's a really awesome design choice. Though so that one is flat. It's kind of telling me to ride it up. And go over the world. Hey look! Secret exit. So I guess now... Need to get back to where I was. And that just leads back up here to the safe house, which I've already been into. So I'll be back to where I was. Okay, I'm just on the other side of that post now. So I will continue on with the level in the intended manner. And continuously get hurt. Because I can't actually see the black pixels of those uh, spikes so I don't actually know where I can uh, be safe from them and that was I call shenanigans because I was not touching the sprite and it clipped one pixel of my feet there we go now hopefully hey look at that literally the end of the level Yet again, where the uh, secret exit was. Okay. Well, let's move on. What is uh, the next level? It's yellow, which is always good for me. The levels are so much better. Be careful of this poison water. One false step and down goes your life. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Please fall in. No, you are a mean, mean message box. Which, I'm almost thinking you're not the message box, you're like Bowser. Also, um, it's getting darker. It's getting, like, nighttime. <laughs> and I'm, like, popping over the bridge and everything, which is so... Just, eh. Okay, well, I can't make it! What the? Oh! No, it doesn't doesn't take down my life. It, like, takes down the uh, timer for the level. That's so weird. That is... I, I guess... You know, I guess you don't have time, quote-unquote, in the levels. You have... A life meter that is constantly draining is just weird, but okay. And let's just do this castle to end the episode. So, coastal castle. If you can tell, a lot of the levels really are pretty short in their runtime. So, yeah, doing a castle isn't too bad. No. Okay, well, let's get on over here. Oh, bloody spikes! Uh, pea balloon! No one likes those. Really, no one does. <laughs> Why did you add it? Okay, I will point out and ask how the spikes over here 
above lava uh, got blood on them. I mean, I could understand the ones that are like right over the pee balloon, but uh, the ones that are like over the lava. Uh huh. I'm just what do you think you're doing? It costs five coins to see the wizard come back when you have five coins. Are you kidding me? Hmm. Is that like a secret exit or something? Or a shortcut? No idea. I care not about you, Mushroom. I care not. Oh, I do care about the slowdown. It is real. Can I? I wonder. I can. I can... Just kind of skip that part by uh, jumping on blargs. Hmm. Does that put me back at the beginning? No. Puts me into a bat room, though. Ceiling bats are the worst type of bats. Okay, well. Let's me do that. I think I'm supposed to be running this entire thing like a gauntlet. But, uh, you don't really have to run it. Let's see... How far can I get without pressing the on-off button? About here. Is that about here? There we go. Since the entire room is on-off switch controlled. And very, very laggy at that. Okay, I'm expecting a coin that I'm not finding anywhere. Really, I didn't see any coin. If I let the thing fall? No. Nothing. Well, that area was, like, coinless. So I only have, uh... Well, there we go. That makes up for the one coin I did not get. Now I have four. There's five. Okay. I think at this point it's like, ah, what what can I do now? I have no idea. All the rest of the coins. That's all he needs. Yeah. So there we go. Five coins. Took them all away. Don't want the fire flower. And boss time. Hello, Koopa Dude. Who is very not what I wanted to do. Don't really like this boss. Um, I mean, he is, he is a guy that's been around as a boss type enemy. I've never really liked him though. Just because he's rather just annoying. Welcome to the show. For my first trick, I will make you disappear. Okay. Um, I guess I now need to get him to shoot magic. Oh, this is going to be hard. Especially with uh, the Roto Blade. And the fact my spin magic kills uh, his stuff. Go! Can you please just shoot like right there or something? Yes. Perfect. Shoot right there. Almost. Right above you. Okay. If I can. Right there. No. Right here. <laughs> right above you. It's not above you. Very not above you. Almost on here. How are you that bad at firing magic? Why are you that bad at magic? Okay. There we go. And key and keyhole. Well, that was a secret exit. I guess there's a normal exit too. Hills, which I will be right back as I explore. 
Okay, well, I found this. So, right under me is the place where you have to spin jump on the saw blade to get across to the pea balloon. Well, right before that, there's a ball and chain. You can go up here, open this up. But if you go back here, uh, you can get to this door. Huh. Which is just a gigantic shortcut. Huh. Okay. Well, no real point in doing that, but yeah. So that's a thing. Anyway, I'm going to assume that's it for that level. I'm going to call it here. This has been Ninja Boy, and I will be back later with more Mushroom Kingdom Meltdown. See you guys then.